New Zealand racing industry has lost a true icon in former jockey and trainer Trevor John McKee, who passed away at the age of 81 following a long illness. McKee was born in the Thames Valley area, the oldest son of Sid and Thelma McKee, and older brother of Alan. Upon leaving school, McKee was indentured to Tom Morrow at Tirapa, alongside fellow apprentice Alan Jones. Morrow, a part-time builder, also had his two apprentices working towards building apprenticeships, but racing would remain their first love. For McKee, stints with Ray Wallace and Ray Cotter followed, and at the end of his apprenticeship, he was drafted into the New Zealand Army where he worked as a cook. The job added weight to his lean frame, which became problematic when he returned to the riding ranks, and therefore a transition to training was made. Around the same time, McKee married Nolene Walker, and the couple had three children, Suzanne, Stephen and Donna. Son Stephen said it was a horse called Proud Chief that set his father's training career on the right track. He said his father raced the Avondale Cup winner all over the country, and literally trained him from a horse float. From winning races around the country to winning races around the world, alongside son Stephen, the McKees formed a successful and ultimately formidable training partnership, thanks in part to champion race mare Sunline. But the champion mare is going to kill them. She's five in front, Sunline, and a piece of racing history, back-to-back -back Cox plates for the champion mare Sunline. She's won it by six lengths easily. When she retired in 2002, Sunline had furnished a record of 48 starts for 32 wins, including two Cox Plates at Mooney Valley, two Doncaster Handicaps at Randwick and a Hong Kong Mile at Happy Valley. Her stake earnings of over 14 million New Zealand dollars was, at the time, a record for a horse trained in Australasia. While records are incomplete, McKee's son believes his father trained around 1,200 winners both in partnership and in his own right. McKee loved ballroom dancing, driving the horse float and training winners. But more than that, he loved his family and leaves behind wife Nolene, his three children, five grandchildren and one great-granddaughter. McKee won the Outstanding Contribution to Racing Award in 2012, but it's fair to say his contribution to the sport will live on for many years to come.